Now Joseph is a dreamer. And as he has dreams, he actually shares with the rest of his family about how high he is on the pedestal and how low they are. In fact, they're basically all going to look up to him at some point in some time. That is what he believes based on the dreams that God has given him. And even his dad kind of cautions him against this. What I want you to look at now is what dreams did you used to have? What dreams did you used to have that you thought this is going to happen and I'm hoping this will happen and this will be the next thing that I'm going to do? And then what happened to one day make those dreams start coming about? What happened? Where'd they go? Are you a dreamer? Did you stop dreaming? Do you desire to dream again? Because I believe that God has a purpose for you and God has a purpose for me because His Word shares that with us. And if that's the case, then we need to start dreaming again. So I want to challenge yourself tonight. You challenge you, I'm going to challenge me. What is a dream that I can start to dream again? And what am I going to do about it to put God first in it so that I can live the dreams that He desires for me? Now remember, this is His will, not yours. So make sure that as you're dreaming, that as you take each step of the way, that you walk alongside of Him with Him leading you, holding your hand and taking you step by step because His dreams are your dreams and it's your purpose that you live through Him. We'll see you tomorrow.